The very commercialized Easter is just around the corner, but before bringing out the Bunny Day decor, Christians have a heavier holiday to observe. Good Friday, which comes the Friday before Easter Monday, has a depressing, yet very revered history. Good Friday, according to Christian belief, marks the day that Jesus, who is considered the Son of God, or God manifested in human form, was crucified and died a human death. The day was full of suffering and pain, Jesus carried his own cross to his crucifixion, with a sea, round of thorns on his head, which is portrayed in many religious images of the figure. But why is such a dark day called good? In the Christian faith, Jesus died on the cross as the ultimate act to forgive humanity of its sins, and open the gates, of heaven. This implies that Jesus' self, sacrifice, and afterlife for the natural, born sinners of the earth would not exist. It's explained in the Bible for if we have been united, with him in a death like his, we will certainly also be united, with him in a resurrection like his. The actual source of the term Good Friday name has been debated for some time. One possibility is that it comes from an interpretation of God's Friday, according to NewAdvent.org. This is the version maintained in the Catholic Encyclopedia, 